So we're going to solve this uh, equation. It's an exponential equation. The first thing that you need to know about this problem is that you need to make the bases the same. We have a square root of 2 on the left and a 4 on the right. So I'm going to write off to the side here something you should know. That the square root of 2 is actually equal to 2 to the 1 half power. 4 is also equal to 2 to the 2 power. Using this information I can substitute back in. This is going to go here. And this is going to go here. So our new equation is going to be 2 to the half instead of the square root of 2. Still got, has the uh, x plus 1 power here equals 2 squared, that's instead of the 4, but it's still got the exponent of an x. Next I'm going to distribute these exponents. This 1 half is going to get distributed here and here to the x and to the 1, and the 2 is going to get distributed to the x. So our equation now is 2 to the 1 half x plus 1 half equals 2 to the 2x. Now, to solve this equation, we need to understand that if we have these bases the same, this 2 and this 2, the bases are the same, then the exponents have to be equal. So we can set them equal. So we have 1 half x plus 1 half equals 2x. My next step <clears throat> I'm going to get all the x's on one side, so I'm going to subtract half x from both sides. That'll give me 1 half equals 2 minus 1 half x. Do this off to the side. If you put 2 in terms of uh, denominator having a, a, a 2 on bottom, denominator 2, then it will be 4 over 2 minus 1 half. 4 over 2 is the same thing as 2. And when I subtract 4 over 2 minus 1 over 2, I get 3 over 2 x. To finish solving this, I'm going to mul multiply by the reciprocal of 3 halves, which is 2 thirds. The reason I do this is because the 3's here will cancel, and the 2's will cancel, leaving just the x there. I'm going to also do that to the other side. And if you'll notice, the 2's there will cancel. And that'll leave a 1 on top and a 3 on bottom, or 1 third. 1 third equals x. And that's your answer.